Streaming live now on News8000.com. You're watching WKBT Lacrosse. This is News 8 Now at noon. Good afternoon and thanks for watching News 8 Now at noon. I'm Dua Shrar. A few traffic alerts for Lacrosse and Onalaska area viewers this afternoon. State Road 16 near Lancel Road in Onalaska will be undergoing repairs due to the concrete buckling during last week's heat wave. Goddard Street between Caroline and Bainbridge Streets in Campbell will also be closed today for sewer work. That closure is expected to last for the next two weeks. Small businesses and small business and nonprofit leader Rebecca Cook held a cookout in La Crosse. The event was held at Badger Hickey Park to help bring awareness of her campaign for the third congressional district seat. That seat is currently being held by Republican Derek Van Orden. During the event, Cook outlined some of the policies her campaign would focus on if they won the election in November. Making health care more affordable and accessible to folks. Yep. I'm hearing from a lot of people in this district concerns about affordable housing, so expanding community, um, federal community block grant, um, and then finally to increase the federal minimum wage to $15 an hour. Cook plans to do a 19-county district tour to help drum up support for her campaign. Definitely off to a nice start this afternoon as we are looking at mostly sunny weather conditions that continue all across the Cooley region. Uh, just looking at a few passing clouds on the satellite picture, but other than that, uh, conditions are looking dry. Current temperatures are into the uh, mid to upper 70s, 78 in Eau Claire. Same temperature down south in La Crosse as well, just, uh, just shy of the 8 degree mark in Winona. 77 for Sparta, and same down in Bosqueville, 76 for Oakwa, 78 in Black River Falls. Look at that gorgeous view there from City Cam 8 in La Crosse. You can see some of those puffy cumulus clouds there in the distance. We may see some more of those here later today. Mostly sunny with seasonable temperatures as highs pick up into the low 80s and a light southwest wind at around 5 to 10 miles an hour during the day. Now stay tuned. I'll have a check on your full weather forecast coming up in a few minutes and we're going to talk about uh, the seasonable trend with temperatures, but a big warm up here could be on the way uh, later on down the road. We'll talk about that here coming up as well. Dua. Thanks, Derek. The Big Brothers Big Sisters of the Seven Rivers region held a community movie night at Copeland Park. Event attendees received a $5 food voucher that could have been used towards any of the food trucks that were on site during the event. The first 50 attendees also received a free dessert. One organizer said that the event was a fun way to spread awareness about the Big Brothers Big Sisters organization. Um, we have pamphlets with all the information about our programs, um, what we do in the community, offering one-to-one -one mentoring for uh, youth that need and matching them with caring, uh, trusted adults. The movie of the night was Puss in Boots, The Last Wish. Zittleman also said that Big Brother Big Sisters of the Seven Rivers region has events planned at Pizza Ranch and Fox Hollow Golf Course next month. For more information, we will have a link on news8000.com. The largest hunt in decades for the Scotland's fabled Loch Ness Monster is wrapping up. Researchers use new technology to try to finally prove the existence of the elusive beast. CBS's Ian Lee reports from Loch Ness, Scotland. There's a mystery lurking in the north of Scotland. In this land of mountains, mist and music, the legend of the Loch Ness Monster looms large. Do you want to believe? Uh, yes, definitely, of course. Yeah, I mean, that's why I'm here. I mean, I wouldn't have trekked out in this weather to, <laughs> to see nothing. Caroline McNamara from New Jersey joined hundreds of volunteers in the largest search in 50 years. Unfortunately, we didn't see much today because of the weather. The legend of the monster dates back to the 6th century and an alleged encounter by an Irish monk. But it really took off in 1933 with a sighting of a whale-like creature. This latest search used state-of-the-art technology. We've got drones going up tonight, so they'll be using thermal imaging cameras. And underwater devices listen to what's lingering in the deep. We've started to detect noises which we haven't heard before, uh, and we can't answer them. The secrets of these waters have attracted scientists, monster hunters, and of course, millions of tourists. Trudy Priya traveled from North Carolina to try her luck. Everybody's here seeing Nessie, and I was, I can't drive by without seeing Nessie. Is this kind of a bucket list thing? Yes, 100%. And the Gaelic gift shops make sure monster hunters don't go home empty handed. What would Loch Ness be then without Nessie? 
would just be a very, very beautiful part of the country. But we don't have anything that has caught the world's imagination like the Loch Ness Monster. But with no definitive proof discovered, imaginations can continue to run wild. Ian Lee, CBS News, Loch Ness, Scotland. The weekend search also took advantage of another modern piece of technology, people's cell phones. It's the largest search hunt since the devices were invented. Well, from school to the stadium, a local music teacher took his talents all the way to Lambeau Field. Hunter Evenson has loved singing for as long as he can remember. Growing up in Galesville, he sang in jazz ensembles, concert choirs, and a cappella groups. After getting his music education degree at Viterbo, he now teaches choir to K-12 students in the Norwalk, Ontario, Wilton District. In his free time, he still participates in local musicals and posts singing videos on social media. As a Wisconsin native, he's naturally a born and raised Packers fan, and he's recently found a way to bridge his love of singing of, with the green and gold. At the beginning of the year, he sent a video of himself singing the national anthem, not knowing if anything would come out of it. But in early August, he got a stunning message. He'd be singing the national anthem at the Packers' final preseason game. I was in utter shock because, you know, coming from <laughs> coming from where I uh, where I am now, I just wasn't expecting a response. Evenson says the biggest that was the biggest crowd he has ever performed in front of. It was also his first Packers game ever. Before his performance, he said he was focused on making his family and the Cooley region proud. Well, coming up on News 8 Now at Noon, we'll explain why you might want to wait before you get your next COVID booster shot. And a potential auto worker strike is receiving national attention. We'll have the details after the break. We're busy. <laughs> I get it. So Stanton Optical works with your schedule. Buy online, pick up in-store, same day, and get a free fitting. I mean, look at my to-do list. Skip the wait. Get your kids' glasses made the same day, only at Stanton Optical. Attention homeowners, we're looking for 50 homeowners who need a new bath or shower. We want to evaluate our custom bathing solutions in real homes for safety and convenience. Call Mad City Baths, Wisconsin's number one remodeler and trusted local source for American-made baths and showers installed in as little as one day. And with our price lock guarantee, we'll guarantee your price for one year. Now 50 homeowners will save. Receive free installation of a new bath or shower. Zero down, zero payments, and zero interest for 24 months. Senior and military discounts plus call during this program and receive a free $50 Walmart gift card with your in-home estimate. From La Crosse, Eau Claire, in western Wisconsin, call with zip code and location to qualify, 715-941-1303. That's 715-941-1303. Hearing loss is everywhere. Everyone is at risk for hearing loss. One in three people age 65 and older have hearing loss. Early detection and intervention are crucial for minimizing the impact of hearing loss. At Belltone, you get more than just hearing aids. You get a hearing partner that's with you every step of the way. Belltone has been providing hearing care in the La Crosse and Eau Claire area for over 63 years. Our hearing care professionals lead the way in training and education. Belltone of the Chippewa Valley and Cooley region with 11 locations throughout western Wisconsin and southeastern Minnesota. Oh, hello. Hi. Did you know that every load of laundry could be worth as much as $300? Really? And your clothes just keep getting more damaged the more times you wash them. Downy protects fibers, doing more than detergent alone. See? This one looks brand new. Saves me money. I'm starting to like Downy. Downy saves loads. This adorable shelter pet wants to meet you and your family today. The News 8 Now Pet of the Week is brought to you by Wisconsin Veterinary Orthopedics. At Stanton Optical, you get great value on eye care, including contacts. Right now, get a one-year supply of AccuView Oasis and an eye exam for only $189. Scan now to book your eye exam. Yay, technology! U.S. stocks ended last week in the green after Federal Reserve Chairman Jerome Powell's speech signaling further interest rate hikes could be needed to cool inflation. 
The Dow jumped 247 points, the Nasdaq rose 126 points, and the S&P 500 gained 29 points. Wendy Gillette has the latest business headlines from New York. U.S. Commerce Secretary Gina Raimondo has kicked off a four-day trip to China for meetings with government and business leaders in Beijing and Shanghai. Secretary Raimondo says her goals include strengthening commercial relations and boosting travel and tourism between the world's two largest economic powers. This is the first time a U.S. Commerce Secretary has traveled to China in seven years. President Biden says he's concerned over a potential auto worker strike. Friday, the United Auto Workers announced that an overwhelming 97 percent of union members voted to authorize a strike if contract negotiations fail with the big three U.S. automakers, Ford, General Motors and Stellantis. The union is asking for a 40 percent pay hike, pensions for new hires and other benefits. The deadline for an agreement is September 14th. And Netflix has already announced the end of its DVD mailing service on September 29th. But now there's some good news for those subscribers. The company says after that date, it will no longer charge customers for unreturned discs, essentially allowing users to keep them for good. That's your CBS News Money Watch report. For more, log on to CBSMoneyWatch.com. At the CBS Broadcast Center, I'm Wendy Gillette. That's it for your afternoon consumer news. As we head to break, here is a live look at the New York Stock Exchange. Stay with us. More news is next. One in three adults have difficulty getting in and out of the bathtub. But with a new walk-in shower from Mad City Baths, you can easily step in and out. Plus, add stability with a safety seat and grab bars. Expertly installed in as little as one day. As you get older, it gets harder to get in those regular standard tubs, you know, so this is really convenient for me, too. Call now the first 50 homeowners who need a new bath or shower will receive special savings. Free installation of a new bath or shower, zero down, zero payments, and zero interest for 24 months. Senior military discounts plus call during this program and receive a free $50 Walmart gift card with your in-home estimate. From La Crosse, Eau Claire, in western Wisconsin, call with zip code and location to qualify, 715-941-1303. That's 715-941-1303. Hey folks, Ronnie Craig here inviting you out to the 26th annual Elvis Explosion live at the La Crosse Center, September 8, 9, and 10. Come and see over 20 Elvis tribute artists from all over the world. Battle it out for $25,000 in cash. Tickets for this rocket weekend are available at the box office, Ticketmaster.com, or Days of Shows. That's the Elvis Explosion live at the La Crosse Center, September 8, 9, and 10. See you there, or you ain't nothing but a hound dog. News 8 is once again proud to support the Gunderson Medical Foundation and remind you, it's time to go stepping out in pink. Join thousands of others on September 9th at Riverside Park as we walk for a cure. Funds raised will support breast cancer research and patient support programs at Gunderson Health System. Get a team together and register at steppingoutinpink.org or participate virtually and make a donation. Let's step out together and make a difference. September 9th, we'll see you there. Why astronauts may be more susceptible to disease and why you may not want to rush out and get a COVID booster just yet. Bradley Blackburn has the day's top health stories. The head of the CDC suggests maybe waiting a few weeks before getting another COVID-19 shot. Dr. Mandy Cohen says updated vaccines targeted against recent variants are expected to be available this fall. It's important to note that if you do get the current COVID-19 vaccine now um, or in early September, it could delay your ability to get this updated vaccine that's coming out in the middle of September. However, so, Cohen yeah. says the unvaccinated and those who are vulnerable may not want to hold off, and she recommends talking to your doctor about what's best. The ideal bedtime temperature for older adults is between 68 and 77 degrees, according to researchers from Harvard Medical School. They find there's a 5 to 10 percent drop in sleep efficiency when temperatures are above 77 degrees. 
The study looked at nearly 11,000 nights of sleep from people 50 and older. Researchers say this highlights how climate change could lead to potential issues unique to the aging population. As space agencies around the world try to send astronauts deeper into the universe, there's concern about a body's ability to fight infection. Swedish researchers say T-cells become less effective over two weeks in zero gravity because they become immature, meaning they act like they've never encountered diseases before. But after 21 days, the T-cells adapt to zero gravity and mostly regain their abilities. Those are some of today's top health stories. Bradley Blackburn, CBS News, New York. Well, that's it for our medical news today. Here is a live look at City Cam 8. Derek is in next with our forecast. Mad City Baths takes the hassle out of bathroom remodeling with high quality American made baths and showers back with a lifetime warranty. Choose from premium wall patterns including white travertine, Othello and many more. And with our price lock guarantee, we'll guarantee your price for one year. And now 50 homeowners who need a new bath or shower will receive special savings. Free installation of a new bath or shower, zero down, zero payments, and zero interest for 24 months. Senior military discounts plus call Mad City Baths now. Last chance to call during this program and receive a free $50 Walmart gift card with your in-home estimate. From La Crosse, Eau Claire, in western Wisconsin, call with zip code and location to qualify, 715-941-1303. That's 715-941-1303. If you're shopping for a vehicle and wonder what website has local vehicles listed, check out findcars.com because findcars.com is locally based. You'll find thousands of vehicles listed from local dealers and private sellers all over the area. Plus, it's so easy to use. Simply choose the vehicle you're looking for and findcars.com will show you who has what you're looking for locally and beyond. Findcars.com, local shopping made easy. Findcars.com. Click it. When I first learned about my Dupuytren's contracture, my physician referred me to a hand specialist. And I'm glad he did, because when I took the tabletop test, I couldn't lay my hand flat anymore. The first hand specialist I saw only offered surgery, so I went to a second hand specialist who also offered non-surgical options, which felt more right for me. So what I'd say to other people with Dupuytren's contracture is this. Don't wait. Find a hand specialist trained in non-surgical options today. I found mine at findahandspecialist.com. The Board Store Home Improvements. Everyday low prices on bathroom remodels for seniors and families. Contact us today for a prompt, free estimate. News 8, your home for Super Bowl 58. Seeing some cumulus clouds there in the distance from City Cam 8 in downtown La Crosse indicating that we do have fair and quiet weather conditions across the area. Temperatures are now at 78 degrees. Wind speeds are looking light at around 4 miles an hour. Visibility looking good here around 10 miles for your lunch hour. 78 degrees uh, with clear skies are the current conditions now being felt in Eau Claire. A little bit gusty, 24 mile per hour wind gust here uh, from the southwest. Currently sustained though at 9 miles an hour. So watch out for some higher wind gusts here up towards the Chippewa Valley here for portions of the area. The south afternoon, but uh, as you can see on the satellite and radar picture, things are looking quiet. I've got a few passing afternoon clouds, but that's about it with current temperature readings, mainly into those mid to upper 70s. We've got 77 in Sparta, same down in Viroqua. I also go basketball pretty sheen, sharing the same temperatures there. 79 currently for areas like west towards the Winona area. We'll be at 80 degrees though by 1 o'clock, followed by 82 degrees at 3 under mostly sunny skies. 83 degrees, mostly sunny by 5 p.m. And then by 7, I expect partly cloudy skies. Temperatures uh, around 81 degrees. So not too far off from what we're going to have here for the rest of the day. And our afternoon highs will be mainly into those low to mid 80s this afternoon. That high of 82 degrees this afternoon, no clear expected. Still expecting a high today around La Crosse of 84 degrees come later today. So right now we're under the influence of clear skies. We're going to be looking at a little bit of a trough of low pressure that could sneak in some cloud cover for the Chippewa Valley as we head to about 4 o'clock this afternoon. And as that system continues to move south, there is a slight chance of a shower or stray, uh, stray evening or 
late night thunderstorm, if you will, possible here for portions of the area. But those rain chances really don't look pretty good at all. They're very, very minimal at around 10 to 20 percent here for some of us. And then after that, that should clear out by uh, 4 a.m. tomorrow. We'll be looking at uh, just looking at a few passing clouds and a northerly wind here behind that trough as well as we head into the day tomorrow. And a few passing clouds along that northerly breeze, certainly possible, but otherwise expect mainly clear skies as we head through tomorrow and also as we take you into tomorrow night. So a check now on your eight day forecast showing that we will be looking at highs into the uh, low to mid 80s here throughout the next several days, at least through Thursday. And then we're going to be looking at highs warming up into the upper 80s to low 90s as we head into Friday and Saturday, followed by highs into the uh, upper 90s. It looks like as we head into Sunday and then once again into early next week on Monday, low temperatures into the 50s and 60s. Enjoy the cooler end of the spectrum this week. Yeah, enjoy that seasonable air while it lasts before that next possible heat wave could be coming soon. All right. So, yeah. Thanks, Derek. All right. Well, coming up on News 8 Now at Noon, a new referendum for the Norwalk, Ontario, Wilton School District is looking to provide changes. But how soon until they're complete? Chart your career with a fabricator position at Chart Industries. Starting wage up to $30 per hour with no experience necessary. Excellent pay and awesome benefits. Apply now at jobs.chartindustries.com. I have type 2 diabetes, but I manage it well. It's a little pill with a big story to tell. I take one daily Jardians at each day start. As time went on, it was easy to see. I'm lowering my A1C. Jardians works 24-7 in your body to flush out some sugar. And for adults with type 2 diabetes and known heart disease, Jardians can lower the risk of cardiovascular death, too. Jardians may cause serious side effects, including ketoacidosis that may be fatal, dehydration that can lead to a sudden worsening of kidney function, and general yeast or urinary tract infections. A rare life-threatening bacterial infection in the skin of the perineum could occur. Stop taking Jardians and call your doctor right away if you have symptoms of this infection, ketoacidosis, or an allergic reaction, and don't take it if you're on dialysis. Taking Jardians with the sulfonylurea or insulin may cause low blood sugar. Jardians. The Board Store Home Improvement. Improve your home to improve your life. Enjoy the comfort, convenience, and beauty of new windows and doors. Enjoy maximum performance when they are installed by the Board Store's very experienced and factory certified installers. Relax knowing you get your best price up front. No gift cards, no free stuff, and no pressure. Superior product, superior installation at a price lower than most others. Invest wisely. The Board Store Home Improvement's prompt free estimates. Chart your career with a fabricator position at Chart Industries. Starting wage up to $30 per hour with no experience necessary. Excellent pay and awesome benefits. Apply now at jobs.chartindustries.com. The 8000 Plus app. Stream on your time. Today marked the first day of school for the Norwalk, Ontario, Wilton School District. While students will be adjusting to their new classes, district officials are ready for the latest referendum. The Norwalk District was granted $24.9 million to provide the highest level of education to their community. The project includes renovations, including classrooms, labs, technical education, and agricultural areas. Additionally, the school will be renovating their classic gym into an auditorium with seating, storage, and a new band room. Superintendent Travis Anderson says he's looking forward to the school year ahead. Just having the kids back, having the kids back brings that added sense of uh, uh, joy and, and energy. And, uh, you know, our referendum obviously is going to be taking shape here. Our track and football field, Fiat Space, will be starting construction potentially next week. The project is expected to be completed in the fall of 2025. For more information regarding the story, visit news8000.com or download the News 8000 app. Stay with us. We'll have one more check of your forecast when we return. Action! Get up to 60% off list prices on hundreds of items at the huge Labor Day sale at Slumberland Furniture. This awesome reclining sectional comes with a free recliner. How about a Lazy Boy recliner as low as $3.98? Do not miss this one.
Get 11% off everything now at Menards. Check out our lighting showroom and update your home's exterior. Patriot Lighting is available in so many unique styles and finishes, you're sure to find a look that's right for you. With more than 300 stock lights priced under $100. Pick up this Treehouse Outdoor Wall Light for $21.97 after 11% rebate. Visit our lighting showroom or check out all our lighting options on Menards.com. Save big money at Menards. To everyone who's hungry for something special. Culver's is the place for us. Hi, what can I make fresh for you today? It's nice to be greeted by people who are glad to see you. And I appreciate that they use real ingredients like fresh beef and Wisconsin cheese. The frozen custard is so fresh and creamy, it tastes like it was made just for us. It's our pleasure. Just spending time with family, that's what mealtime at Culver's is all about. From Wisconsin with love, welcome, welcome to Delicious! delicious. When you're injured in an accident, one mistake could cost you a lot of money. Nobody knows bikers and the law like Hupie and Abraham. They know how to get you all the money that you deserve. It costs nothing for you to contact Hupie and Abraham, and they will never take a fee unless they win your case. They got me way more than I thought I would get. Hupie and Abraham mean business. Call Hupie and Abraham right now. Tell the insurance company you mean business. I don't know how it's all going to fit. Action! Now at Slumberland, $9.99 gets you a lot. Like a Sealy Posturepedic mattress and an adjustable power base, both just $9.99. Need a twin? Get a Sealy starting at just $1.29. The huge Labor Day mattress sale. Only at Slumberland. The First Warren Weather App. Download it today. Get the day's news in your inbox. Email newsletters from News 8 Now. Sign up today. Go to news8000.com slash newsletters to get started. Final check now on your eight-day forecast. A high of 84 today under mostly sunny conditions. Highs in the low to mid-80s through Thursday under mostly sunny skies here too. Now we're expecting temperatures to warm up into the upper 80s Friday and Saturday, followed by highs into the mid-90s on Sunday and Monday. So it does look like we'll see a bit of another heat wave that could develop, something that we'll definitely be watching closely for trends for as well over those next several days. So keep it here. Keep you updated. Still summer. Yeah, it still feels like summer, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you for watching News 8 Now at Noon. We'll see you back here later tonight at 5, 6, and 10. Have a wonderful Monday.